Hello everyone, this is Maher Haddad. Today I have decided to make a new uh, video uh, on my YouTube channel to speak about how you can block the PUBG Mobile using the Microtech Creator OS. PUBG Mobile is a game that uh, a lot of people play it. So uh, I have received a lot of uh, uh, emails and a lot of uh, uh, messages uh, from uh, a lot of people asking me how we can block PUBG Mobile on Microtech. So that's the reason why I have decided to do this video. So let's go directly to show you what I have done and uh, I will show you directly if the PUBG Mobile will be blocked or not. So here is my Microtech router which is connected to the internet. If you can see, I have um, enabled the DHCP client on WLAN 2. So it's receiving the internet. So this is the WAN interface, uh, the WLAN 2. And this router is connected to the internet. Then I'm at WLAN 1, uh, which is the uh, connection that I'm going to connect my phone to. So this is uh, WLAN 1. Um, it is having PUBG as SSID. And uh, I put it inside a bridge. You can see that. And of course, on this bridge, I have put an IP address. And I have created a DHCP server, so anyone connected to WLAN 1 can get an IP. And of course, I have met the NAT. So we go to the firewall on the NAT, so that is the source NAT. This way, anyone connected to the WLAN 1 can go to the internet and of course receive an IP address. Now, regarding the PUBG. So uh, at the beginning, I was just uh, thinking, how can I collect the IP address of the PUBG servers? So what I have done, I've searched a lot on the internet to find if there are listing of the IP addresses of the servers of PUBG Mobile. I really couldn't find that. So what I have done, I created a filter rule here. You can see now it's disabled, but that's what I've done first. I said anything which is forward means going to the internet from the bridge, meaning from my phone or from my internal network. Then the action is put the uh, uh, destination addresses, so the addresses which are the phone going to them, put them in an address called PUBG. And then I only connected my phone and I only opened PUBG. So I didn't open any other uh, uh, applications because if you open, for example, YouTube or Facebook or whatever, then the IPs of those servers will be in the address list. And I don't want that. I just want the IPs of the PUBG. So I only tried to open and close, open and close PUBG. And I spent like one hour collecting. So all the IPs were going to the address list called PUBG. So after I've done that and I spent like one hour doing that, someone from uh, my uh, friends told me he has the IPs of the servers of PUBG. So I have got that from him. And I've tested and yeah, so I spent one hour <laughs> working and uh, uh, yeah, it was uh, spent on trying to find out the uh, IPs, but this, uh, my friend has already all of them. I've tested them and they're really the IPs of the servers of the PUBG. So I have put them inside an address list. I'm going to leave for you this address list uh, so uh, you can uh, copy paste it to your Microtech router. And then after that, as I have the address list here, I have created here a firewall rule. And I said, anything which is going to the internet to the PUBG addresses, so this is the address list, destination address list called PUBG, and coming from my bridge one, uh, one which is the WLAN one, so this is the wireless I'm connected to, then the action is to drop, yeah? So now I'm going to open PUBG mobile on my phone. First, without applying the, you see the firewall rule is disabled now. So let me just go to my phone and uh, let's uh, open uh, so you can see. Um, here we go. So this is uh, my phone and then I will try to log in as guest to see if it's gonna work. So you can see it is uh, working normally, loading 100%. And then, uh, yeah, I'm uh, inside PUBG. So the game is there and I can start. And I can connect uh, to the game normally without any problem. You can see it's working perfectly. So now what I'm going to do, I have to go here and enable this firewall rule again to write it. I'm going also to leave this script for, for you to put it. Anything forward going to the addresses of PUBG, 
coming from my bridge one action is to drop. So I'm going to just enable it. And I'm going here to close PUBG again. And of course, it's better that you wipe the connections because those connections are already open for PUBG. So I just uh, wipe them. And uh, before I do that, let me just show you that I'm connected. So if we go here, so you can see that I'm connected to the PUBG SSID, which is on the, I put it on the WLAN one, I called it SSID PUBG. So meaning I have connection to uh, or via this Mikrotik router. Very good. So now I will go again to the PUBG after I have enabled the uh, uh, firewall to see if it's going to work. Let's put it again here. So that is now PUBG is starting. Let's see if it's going to work. And if you look here, if we go to the IP firewall, we can see on the filter rules, it's already blocking. You can see the bytes and the package are increasing. And uh, if we go back to the PUBG, you can see before it loaded very fast. Now you can see it's really too slow. And um, in a moment, it will tell me that it cannot connect to the server. And that's the reason why, because this firewall rule is blocking. It's blocking any communication going to the servers of the PUBG. So you can see it's loading, 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 and it's not really going to be connected. And uh, we can wait a little bit to get the, the error saying that it cannot be connected to the server. And this way, you can block PUBG uh, mobile for users. Of course, if you are a, a, an ISP, you may not do that because people want to play it. But if you are for example, having Microtech in a company and you don't want your employees to play PUBG Mobile during the working hours. So what you can do, you can just make this firewall rule, put it on your Microtech router and it works perfectly. You can see, yeah, here we go. Server did not respond. Please return to the login page and try again. So even if you go to the login page again and you try, it's not going to work. So you can see it's just going to be blocking all the time. So that is all what I wanted to show you in uh, this uh, lecture. Uh, it's about how you can block uh, PUBG Mobile from your Microtech router. Uh, if you like my way of teaching, you can uh, subscribe to this channel and also you can become a member. So there is a possibility that you join to this channel as a member and uh, you will get access to a lot of uh, courses that are only for members. It's not, they're not for public. So I'm adding a lot of courses on my YouTube channel only for uh, members uh, who are uh, joining my channel. Uh, so uh, if you are interested, you can also help me uh, because with the membership, I can make a, a little bit more uh, money than a subscriber who watch only my videos. So this is all what I wanted to show you in this lecture. I hope that it was informative for you and I will see you in the upcoming lecture.